This video clip demonstrates how to draw various scenes of a floor from a CAD plan in Relux Pro 2015.1. Open your Relux Pro application and in the Start screen select CAD Import. In the following configuration dialog, enter all the relevant project data. In step 1, set the project type. In this case, select Interior Scene. In step 2, you can specify the type of interior project, which is floor in this case. In step 3, select the CAD file. In step 4, set the corresponding scale. If you don't know the scale, you can measure it in your CAD program or select a termin to find it out. There, you have to find a dimension and select its two points to define the distance. On the following dialog, Enter the distance and then confirm with OK. Once you are back in the main dialog, proceed to step 5 to configure the plan rotation. In most cases, a CAD plan is drawn parallel to the main axis. If not, then you have to rotate them accordingly. In step 6, you have to set the plan origin, which is recommended in most cases. Just select Determine and in the following dialog, select the point where you want to set the drawing's origin in Relux Pro and then confirm with Enter. The same steps apply when you create single rooms from a CAD drawing. After the six-step dialog, a floor is automatically created. All following scenes will be integrated in this floor. Then, start drawing your room geometry by defining the inner points of the walls. With a double click or the Enter key, you can exit the command of the scene geometry. If you hold down the Control key while confirming the room geometry, then the scene properties window automatically opens. As mentioned in a new features video, the dialog box Properties for a scene has been revised and is divided now into four areas. Scene, Evaluation area, Structure and Material. Create a second scene and then switch to the floor view in 3D representation, either by pressing F3 or by selecting the toolbar button. Once all the scenes in the floor have been created, you can add the luminaires. Please note that the usual drag and drop function does not work in this floor level view. To switch to scene view, select the toolbar button or press F8 or double click in the scene directly. By pressing the F8 key or by selecting directly the floor in the project tab, you can view the entire floor plan. Right clicking on the desired scene opens the context menu containing the calculation manager and scene properties. Calculated and non calculated scenes can be now observed at the same time in the 3D view. Each floor level has its own results overview, with the most essential calculation results. There are four categories of distinguishing the floor output in the results overview. If a scene has a green fill color, then it indicates that the nominal values set in the properties were achieved. However, if a scene has a red fill color, then it indicates that the nominal values set in the properties were not achieved. A yellow color fill indicates that there is a calculation result for this scene, but no target values were set. A white color fill indicates that the scene has not been calculated. We also added a new result template in the Print Manager. This template, called Simple, summarizes only the overview results for each floor and each room. To find out more about the optimized user interface in Redux Pro 2015.1, you can watch this in a separate demo video. If you wish to get informed regarding new tutorials and features in Redux Pro, please subscribe to our newsletter and also follow our social media channels. Thank you for watching.